Greetings everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Baldur's Gate. Today we are in front of the Iron Throne Headquarters, which is in the southern area of Baldur's Gate. Just east of where the uh, Seven Sons and the Flaming Fist Castle are. So, Duke Elton wants us to go inside and uh, get some evidence, so we're going to do just that. It will be done. I don't know if we really no time to care for subterfuge, but we'll see. Out, away, fly while you can. There'll be madness here, and I can stand it no longer. Uh, but mad madness is much louder over. In this much louder tower? That there'd be malice here, I have no doubt. But madness? Wait, calm down and explain yourself. Calm down, calm down, while Saravok's acolytes practice their magic cacophony above me. I dare say not, stranger. I dare say not at all. Okay, so... We learned from him, there's a person named Saravok upstairs practicing all magic. My stuff is authentic. Really, it is. What's your business here? This guy sounds like... Dude. Was that... The Bartley guy from Dark Alliance? <laughs> well, you know him if you played it. He's the merchant, and he's annoying. If you're here about obtaining iron shipments from your company, then you best do so elsewhere. All my stuff is authentic. Really, it is. That voice certainly sounds like Bartley. Hey. All my stuff is authentic. Really it is. Who's this guy? What do you want? Welcome to the Anthrone Citadel. Could you please state what business brings you here? Uh I think we could bribe him. Uh, we could try to lie. We've come from something are quite weary. I don't know why I would base this lie on nothing. What is I don't even know what Sambia is. Seeking employment? Uh, absolutely not. I'm here to kill all of those associated themselves with the Iron Throne. Hmm, what do you think? Nah, let's not alert them too much. Let's just give them a couple hundred gold. Yeah, we don't have any questions. Come on in. Yes, six heavily ar armed adventurers just walking in the front door, uninvited. I should have joined the army. Where do you think you're going? Um, the fifth floor, Saravak asked us to deliver an important message to his acolytes. Hmm, better you than me. Working with that crowd could be downright creepy some days. Uh, creepy? How do you mean? I've seen people go up there with, with, well, with one face and come back down with another. I don't know how else to say it. I got a keen eye for faces, I do, and I think, I think the people going up and down know it too. Because one time one of them caught me looking at him, and he winked right at me. And the, and he changed the colors of his left eye right, right as I was watching him. It started out a chocolate brown, but then it went all quicksilver for a moment, like the mercury the mages play with. And then he was gone and out the door, laughing his high-pitched laugh. Yeah, who are these people? Competition of the Iron Throne. Mostly members of the Seven Suns Trading Costa or the Merchants League. They've both been attempting to negotiate a tentative peace between the different economic powers in the city. I fear it's not the peace they're finding, however. At least... Not of the type they came looking for. Something's going on upstairs, and I'd rather not think about it, what it could be. Hmm. This is highly... Not a problem. Suspicious. I would dare say that the Iron Throne is inviting its competitors, eliminating them, and then replacing them with doppelgangers so that they can control their competitors from within. I should have joined the army. Another guard. You there? What are you doing there? I don't recognize you. Go bribe him. Business. Calm down. We're new recruits. Just come from Cormier. Uh, hundred gold. There you go. With ease. Some guards they they have. Don't give me any lip, peasant. Uh -oh. Do you know who I am? Wait a moment. Could you please tell me where I could find Realtar? It's important that I speak with him. I've been given the runaround too long. Realtar's damn son Saravok seems to think he's in charge here. All right, now we're getting somewhere. Realtar was the name that was in the letters that were sent to Daviorn. It is Daviorn's superior. And uh, we've heard of Saravok and his acolytes upstairs. And Saravok is Realtar's son. So these are two people who are very high up in the Iron Throne roster, it seems. Uh, we must ask a name before we're telling the whereabouts of the Iron Throne high ups. I am Norcher, and your Iron Throne high up answers to me. I have just arrived from Selgaunt in Zambia. The council wishes to know how things are faring. Now tell me where I can find Realtar. Uh, ooh. This is another... This is another someone from Sembia. Probably 
invited to be killed and replaced like the others. Um, I don't know. Damn it, is anyone competent here? What about you? At last, someone who looks like they could be of some assistance. The assorted boobs and dimwits around here have been of very little help. Uh, I am dimwit. This is my good friend Boob. And behind me, you'll find brainless and moron. <laughs> How do you do? My apologies. I have a tendency. <laughs> what? I have a tendency of coming across as a bit gruff. It comes with the title of Chief Negotiator for the Grand Dukes, I'm afraid. You may call me Emissary Ta. Now, please, if we could start over, where may I find the stairs to the fifth floor, as it seems I have lost them entirely? Emissary Ta, would it be untoward of me to inquire as to the nature of your business on the fifth floor? It is hardly a secret. The Grand Dukes have sent me to negotiate a new iron treaty with Thaldorn. It appears that the Merchants League and the Seven Sons have voluntarily granted the Iron Throne temporary control over their minds in order to simplify the city's supply structure and therefore and thereby strengthen the war effort, should it come to that. I'm here to ensure that we have access to that iron at a favorable price. The Iron Throne has been more than cooperative with us to date, and I doubt that they will change their tune now. If you'll excuse me, I have no intention of being late for my negotiations. Oh, they're heading up. You don't want to do that. Oh, well, I guess there's no stopping them. Well, I, I gotta say, like, uh, the whole plot and storyline of this game and the writing... Totally it would have gone way over my head had I played this back when it was relevant. Um, I'm glad I'm playing it now. Though, this is nice. I like this, um, this whole... Not a problem. ...political plot thing going on. Let's have a quick save. I think that we can get some information here. What you want? Destus Gurn. Hmm, hello. You must be the city negotiators. Let me see on the list here. Emissary... Emissary Tar... Right on time, and a pleasure to meet you. My name is Destus Gurn, Assistant Chief Accountant for the Iron Throne's operations on the South Coast. Now, as a quick briefing on our negotiating procedures before you head up the stairs, Thaldon will be accompanied by a board of six Iron Throne advisors sent to us from abroad. Zalimar, Cloudwolf, Gardush, Naman, Diab, Asim, and Alai, all of them quite respectable men and eager to meet you. You also have a seventh member on the board that day. On that board today, a Mr. Lyle Espejo. He is there to ensure that things go smoothly in this time of transition. As for the agenda... Uh, yes. On the agenda, as you well know, are a discussion of our current offer regarding iron prices and some notes regarding the output of the new mines we have acquired. Proceeding all of that, however, Mr. Espejo would like to have a few words with you about the positive change in dynamism, economic and otherwise, that he has been witness to in his recent travels through the Sorgos region. I do not doubt that you will find it interesting, but I have taken enough of your time. Please proceed up the stairs. Negotiating a treaty with the city Grand Dukes. Where are these people? Mer merchants. Well, I suppose we have no choice but to head upstairs. And I need to make sure I'm ready. I think we're ready. I suppose we're ready. <sighs> All right, here we go. This is it. Fear my wrath, for it is great indeed. Who dares intrude upon our negotiations? Well, I'm, I suppose there's no uh, lying to these guys. My name is Wake, and I was wondering if I could ask you a few questions. Wake, you say, ah, yes, Saravok warned us you might try to meddle. That meddling will stop here, however. Um, and who are you to say so? I've crushed all of those before you. Those before us were fools, as you are. Those before us were weak, as you are. Those before us are... were not Zalimar, or Gardash, or Naman, or Diabar, or Samalai. Those before us are dead, as you will be. So it has been decreed. So it shall be done. So orders, Saravok. Oh, boy. With ease. So we got, like, a couple mages here. He looks like a... Okay, Archer. That guy might be a mage. That guy's definitely a mage. Again, you disturb me. Whew. All right, where are we gonna? How are we gonna? Can I skull trap them? I have never used skull trap before. This might backfire hugely. <laughs> oh my God! There's a mage over there. 
Night Singer. Give me I don't like this. I think we're gonna get fucked up. Oh, they killed Edwin. I wanna wait. What happened to Skull Trap? Uh, oh my God! It's probably not the best time for experimentation either, though. Oh, try again. With ease. All right, so we got a mage over there, a mage over here. Fuck! Should have attuned or memorized some shit. Uh, um, this is gonna be tough. This is the battle that stumped me before. What if you lie? Uh, oh, I don't think it matters what you say. They just attack you. All right, let's move in. Wake to. Let's move him in. This guy can keep Gardush busy. Let's try to snipe these You're a queer fellow. mages real quick and see if we can I have invisibility handy if I need it. What I need to do is fuck up these mages. Let's acid arrow want that guy. What the fuck? Edwin! He walked right into the line of fire. What are you fucking doing, man? It will be done. Fucking A. Uh, three mages, man. That's a uh, horror. Fuck you all. Old person. Can I, should I do that? Should I command? I don't know. Gardash is feared. Uh, shit. I should have blessed. Oh, man. Let's berserk. Uh, I don't like that. Oh my god! Emoin! Run! Fuck! What the fuck? That fire shit is not cool, bro. Oh my god. What the fuck? Confused, 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 confused. God damn it. Oh, we're fucked. We're fucked. Yep. Fuck. This is exactly the problem I had, is just like the difficulty jump from this fight alone is massive. So let's see. Uh, I may need to go reattune some spells like resist fire or something. So let's try on this side. With ease. And um, what does haste do anyway? I thought it also. Initiative bonus, moving bonus, attack bonus. Yes, it is an attack bonus. Fuck, I should have buffed. Fuck me. Fuck me. Fuck you. All right, uh, I don't, uh, fuck, we need to go for a mage or something. Let's 
go for uh who the hell is casting the spells man is it this guy What the fuck? What are you? What? Why would you walk all the way over there to cast a spell? See? Hey, we got one. Uh, invis. Everybody's confused again. This is stupid. My actions are yours. Horror. What the hell? I don't know what's going on. Everybody's fucked. Okay. Not a problem. This is harder than I remember. This is fucking ridiculous. I haven't had any problems in this game yet, really, and but now I have big problems. Alright. Bless, I guess. Let's put haste on wake. Oh, did that haste everybody? Oh my god! Okay, we might be onto something now. Alright, where the fuck? Who the fuck is casting the goddamn fire spells? They're the, they've gotta die. Alright, let's just like come way back in here. Tech. Uh. Yeah, get him! Get him! Where's that guy? Get him too. You berserk. Ah! Acid. Who's that guy? I just acid on anybody. I, don't, I really don't care. Okay. Next. No, him. Don't cast. Oh, I think that went to confuse. Everybody attack this guy, please. Now the next mage. Uh, okay, we're getting somewhere. Come on. Come on. Yes. Fucking wizards. Oh, you motherfucker. Where's Minsk? Minsk is confused. I think this is Minsk. Oh, that's Zalamar. Wake. I don't know where Minsk is. Oh, he's right there. Okay, I think we got this. And we need the bless and the haste, man. The buffs. It's all about the buffs. <laughs> Magic missile. Magic missile. Onward. Fuck him up. Yeah. If I must. yeah no All right. Woo. Let's wait for the uh the Zerk to wear off. Let's pick this shit up. Guy had some magic, some bracers. Okay, all right, we're good. Throw a heal on me. Oh my God, they had a lot of shit. Look at all of this. All right, um. Cool one. Got a magic halberd, a wand, another mace, uh, another wand, a ring, bracers, 
a warhammer, a medium shield, a bunch of potions, a bunch of magic, and a note. The note says, I have a task for you and those you have selected. You, the first of the faithful, are to stand ground in my stead. Be assured that I would not belittle your devotion with simple guard duty. This chore is of particular interest to me and thus to you. Mike has become a thorn in my side and I wish it removed. Do so and you shall please me grateful. Such is your charge. Do not fail in this, Saravok. Well, Saravok wasn't here. I guess I'll copy this. Alright, there's a statue of what looks like the dude in the opening cinematic that killed Gorion. There's some, uh, Thaldorn is here. Hello! I don't want any trouble. Uh, answer some questions now. You heard to kill me? You can't kill me. Do you know who I am? I am Thaldorn, one of the leaders of the Iron Throne. Uh... <laughs> Tell us or die. Give us incriminating documents, please. Oh, please don't hurt me. You can find everything you need with Real Tower. He's the true leader of the operation. He always carries everything on his person. Sure. Um. Sh should I kill him? Yeah. You must die. Ooh, and he got some stuff too. Nice. Let's see what we can find. Nothing here. Nothing here either. Man, this floor sure has a weird steps, footsteps sound effect. Kind of sounds like it's water. Like, kind of wet or something. Ooh. Edwin? My actions are yours. Not a problem. Uh, Edwin? As directed, for now. You got a couple scrolls. A person lightning bolt. Save spells for later. Alright. <clears throat> Realta, my superiors are intrigued by your proposal. I would like to discuss it further, but not through correspondence such as this. The Harpers and Zens have been very active in the region of late. It would be very unfortunate that they tried to disrupt an alliance between our two organizations. If you, Brunos, and Thaldorn were to meet with us in the safety of Candle Keep, my superiors would be much relieved. Please send a response ASAP. Tooth. Tough. Brunos? This is to Realtar. If Br Realtar, Brunos, and Thaldorn met them, whoever this is, in Candle Keep. So there's someone in Candle Keep, it seems. What about this other one? Father, I have received your letter, and I can assure you that the mercenaries led by Wake will no longer trouble our operations. I have dealt with them personally. No, you didn't. Before dying, they were most forthcoming in their revelations. What? It is, as you surmised, they were agents of the Zentarum. Uh, impersonators? I am also writing to tell you that I cannot attend the meeting at Kendall Keep. Some problems have arisen with the Chill and the Black Talons. They have had trouble working with each other, and I am needed there to smooth over any dissension. Okay. So, we've uncovered even more bullshit. Who's this tough guy, and why is he in Candle Keep, and is he responsible for the murder yeah, of Gorion? Not a problem. At least by giving information to these folk, whoever they be. Hmm. I believe it's now time to return to Scar and report our findings. However, we must be careful on the way out. With ease. Well, that was a hard-fought battle, but um, I guess I can just <laughs> give all of my praise to haste I and bless. The flaming fist. Hello. Hello there, friends. May I have a word to relax? I'm not here to hurt you. May I have a weird voice? I know you where you've been attacked at almost every turn, but I'm an ally, true and sure. Uh, why should I believe you? You have no reason to trust me, but you also have no reason not to. Regardless, I am but a messenger. I was told by Scar to keep an eye on you, though you seem quite capable of taking care of yourselves. In this case, I think you would benefit from a visit with Scar or Duke Elton. Very well. He awaits your arrival now. Just proceed to the blink. I was going there anyway. Why? What is the meaning of this? I was sent here in the first place by them. Sheesh. Not a problem. This way, good sir. Over here. What do you want? This way, good sir. Over here. You already see Duke Elton just go up the stairs. He should be waiting in his office. All right. What? What stairs? Oh, these are stairs. Okay. It will 
will be Hello, done. Duke. Greetings, taxpayers. Greetings. I am Duke Eltan, commander taxpayers. of the Flaming Fist. Glad to have you back. So what have you learned so far? Hmm. Let's see. Uh, number three, yes. This is true. What else? We know that there are incriminating events to be found with real tar. Yes, the overall leader of the Iron Throne. He's currently supposed to be at the Candle Keep on some sort of business. Number three. I don't know what the leaders are in there, but some of someone is. Let's go number four. Then there is only one thing to do. Travel to Candle Keep and learn what they're doing there. Whatever it is, it can't bode well for the fortunes of this city. Take this book. Without it, the Keeper of the Portal won't allow you entrance into the library. Here also is the reward money. Your journey has come full circle. Duke Elton has asked that you travel back to Candlekeep, where you must spy upon the leaders of the Iron Throne. While it troubles you that such evil men now make use of the Great Library, and you wish the circumstances of your visit would be different, it will still be a pleasure to return to your former home. Uh, really? Kind of foreboding with the skull on the page and stuff. Okay. Now where am I? Oh, I'm in Candle Keep? What the fuck? That was fast. Well. Uh. I'm gonna end the episode here. This gets out the point, and we'll pick this up next time. So, uh, return, and we will journey into Candle Keep to uncover this evil blood. We will destroy the evil. Nah. All right, whatever. See you.